She was perhaps best known for the middle-aged, middle-class, suburban couple in the 70s sitcom Terry and June. Now that I've got a job, you said we'd share the chores. What chores? Mine's a boiled egg and a piece of toast. <laughs> But June Whitfield's career as a comedy actress on TV and radio spanned seven decades. Born in South London in 1925, June Whitfield started her career in radio. And by 1959, she'd made her first appearance in a carry-on film. I was cold in the night and there was no hot water. The toilet doesn't flush. That coffee is cold. Oh, and that sun is too hot. Apart from that, she's having a wonderful time. Kiss me, kiss me, bite me. What? Bite me. Oh, I can't see I'm a vegetarian. During the 1960s, in the then male-dominated world of television comedy, she managed to carve out the beginnings of a successful career as a character actress. I was just wondering if that sort of thing can run in the family. And by the 90s, June Whitfield was known to a whole new generation as Eddie's scatty mother in Absolutely Fabulous. Inside of me, there's a thin person just screaming to get out. <laughs> just the one, dear. <laughs> Tonight, her co-star Joanna Lumley said, I am heartbroken to lose such a darling friend and she'll never forget her sensational talent, humour and her generosity to us all who had the joy of working with her on AbFab. She will always have a most special place in my heart. Julia Sawala, who played Safi in AbFab, said, Thank you, Dame June Whitfield, for teaching me my craft with such grace and dignity. I always wanted you to know how in awe of you I was. However, you were far too humble to accept my adoration. You were a great source of inspiration to me. Bye-bye, Gran. Rory Bremner said, Always graceful and elegant, with a real comic glint in her eye, and absolutely fabulous timing. Just last year, she was appointed a dame for services to drama and entertainment. Dame June Whitfield died last night, aged 93. Her legacy, some say, she led the way for female comedy.